Okay, as you can see, we're back here at the main screen. This is after the terminal completely downloaded. It reset, reboot itself, unzipped all the files, and now we're at the sale refund void screen. I have here a Discover test card. Um, it's a chip card. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you since we did, have not done the EMV key update, it will not accept a chip card. We're going to press sale. We're just going to do for a dollar. Total correct. Yes. And now it says enter the card number. Swipe or enter. CAPK file not found. So, chip malfunction. Cancelization. Cancelization. Cancel the transaction. So, what we do is the EMV key update. To do an EMV key update, from this main screen, you press the enter key, go into setup, password, it's our trusty one alpha alpha six six eight three one, enter, setup, down, down arrow, down arrow again, down arrow again, down arrow again, EMV key update, I'm going to hit EMV key update, it says no keys present, do we want to download them, yes we do, it's going to dial primary. All right, once it goes through the whole process, it'll do a restart, and you'll see it. it's unzipping and extracting files. And then it'll come up to this main screen, Com Server or SoftPay FDMS. We're just gonna hit SoftPay FDMS, activating app. There we go, sale refund void. It is completely ready to process.